Uh, hey, yo, what's up, gamers? Welcome back to another video. It's me again, Bullets of Tell. Feels like I haven't recorded a video in a long time, even though it's only been a short time. Anyways, I have, I have, I need, I need to talk to you guys about some stuff. Um, I bought a lot of things as of late. Too many things as of late. And it's probably going to take quite a few videos for me to show you all of the cool things that I want to bought, that I bought and wanted to inform you guys but anyways so i'm gonna start off with one of my favorite things a yumi doll a yumi plushie do you guys remember that post i made a while back where i was where i posted a picture of one of these ayumi plushies and i said something about how one day i'm gonna rock up to the hairdressers and use like this thing as like a reference picture and so that i can have my like hair done like it i mean If I put some more effort into my looks, then perhaps I'll be able to look exactly like this thing. But I bought this thing, I've always worn one of these for like months now. Um, and I found this thing online back in September on Trade Me, which is the New Zealand thrift store basically, where you can get secondhand stuff. Um, and I found this thing, that I, I just searched up Ayumi, and this was the only Ayumi plushie that came up for 10 bucks. That's right, 10 buckaroonies. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. That for this. My mom tried looking on Amazon for to get me one because I told her that I really wanted one. But she only found one, ones that were like hundreds of dollars. But I'm so happy I found this thing. It's like the softest thing ever. Thank you to the lady who sold this. It's in mint condition. I, I would brush its hair right now to um, pamper it up for the camera, but... I can't, I, I cannot seem to find my hairbrush, which is strange. Um, but this thing, there's like a lot of different ones. This is the one that represents how... Also, it smells like Juicy Couture, which is my favorite perfume. My mom, she put it in the washing machine to make it clean, and then she sprayed it with Juicy Couture, my favorite perfume. It's so, so soft. You should get one. Okay, next thing I bought. Talking about things that smell nice, the other day I bought some Got To Be Glued, I mean, no, Got To Be Guardian Angel. I have I have a lot of Got, got To Be Glued items now. And this is one of my favorites, because if you guys can't tell, um, my hair is, um, it's falling out. <laughs> it is absolutely fried. Like, I mean, come on, I'm a 13 year old girl. My hair should not be falling out like this. Come on. Like, that's... I mean, it's likely due to the fact that I'm, like, straightening it every day. But I feel as though that, like, if I bought some, uh, heat protectant spray that, fr from, like, a band, from, like, a brand that I actually like, then perhaps I'll be more compelled to use it. Which is true. I use this whenever I wash my hair. Oh, yeah. Another thing I bought. Did I tell you I, I bought this massive bag of warheads? No, like, it's later. It's, like, it's filled to the brim with warheads. These are Warheads rooms in a little baggie, by the way. I still haven't finished them. I bought them months ago. It takes me quite a while to eat things. Gotta savor it. Nutritional information. It's not too scary. Highest serving is 57 calories. Ugh. What is uh, Occasional treat, perhaps. Okay. Also, um, another thing. Look at this wallet I thrifted. It's tiny. It's to hold my coins. And this is, it's literally one of the coolest handcrafted things I've ever seen ever. Because, like, look, it's, like, hand-sewn. Cute little zipper on it. I'm not going to show you the insides because I don't want you all to know how much money I have. Not like this is all my money. Actually, I shouldn't be saying how much money I own. Um, I, I'm not telling that, but like, look how cute it is, and it's like, it has like that thing, and then it's like shiny, it's all textured, and then there's this bit on it, and it's like all sequiny. I love sequins. It's shiny, and I love it. 
I also bought a cute Halloween bow. Well, actually, there's several of these that I bought from several different stores, and they're very cute. I would like to wear one of these to school on Halloween, since Halloween's on a Thursday. Um, however, like, what if my school doesn't allow that? I go to a uniform school. Um... Also, yesterday, I spent almost $8, well, $7.90 buying 10 different CDs. I mean, DVDs. I thought that they were CDs, because, don't tell anyone this, but maybe I, I wanted to acquire some some of my favorite albums and put them on some cute little, little devices so I can listen to them. Um, but no, it turns out they're DVDs. Almost five gigabytes of storage though, so that's pretty cool. And I have a couple of CD slash DVD burners, so, like, I was thinking perhaps instead of, like, 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 um, copying some music onto these, since that doesn't work, of course, what if I, like, I, like, did something else with that? Because, like, I actually have quite a little collection of CDs, like, like, CDs just full of pictures. Fun fact, when I was younger, my parents, they used to, like, my mom, she used to take a bunch of pictures of me, and, like, they would all be labeled, like, all of, like, that, all of the file names, they were all, like, Tower 1, Tower 2, Tower 3, Tower, like, all of them. There are hundreds of them, thousands even, and they're all onto these little CDs, and there's, like, a heap of them. I need to get a cute little, like, CD, like, uh, one of those CD baggies, and, like, I can, oh, that would be so cute, and, like, I could, like, write things, like, like, CD1, and I could give it a, I love naming things, and then I can put it out, like, I need to get a CD bag thing, and it can be, like, pink and sparkly, and have hearts on it, because that's, like, that's, like, my favorite thing ever. I have, like, so many sparkly pink heart things right now, need more. Hey, I also put a bunch of cute little unicorn pencils as well. This is one of them. There's six more of them, and it came with some erases, but erases are horrible. But I, f I think that these were like three dollars fifty for like like six, six of these pencils and six erasers. Um, which is actually quite a steal, to be honest. Bought them from the dollar store. Actually, no, that's not a steal. I bought them from the dollar store. They should be one dollar. But no, it's three dollars. I also bought these DVDs from the dollar store as well. That's... That's strange. Um, I also bought some Halloween nails. Like, fake nails. They're on my dresser. But I, I didn't, like, it would be hard to show them all individually, because there's, like, 12 of them. But they're, like, all of the images are background. Like, I, I mean, they're, they're flipped. So, like, one of them says Happy Halloween, except it doesn't say Happy Halloween because the text is flipped. I, and they're just really flimsy plastic. Anyways, I, I'm so excited to bring these pencils to school, because one of my, um, one of my friends in high school, she has these really cute fairy pencils, like, and I, I am always telling her about my cool stationery, and, because, like, I have a lot of unicorn stationery, I love unicorn stationery. Also, last thing I bought from the doll store yesterday, I bought this cute little, oh, It looks like that. It's a necklace thing. Don't know when I'm gonna wear it because my parents don't like chokers. I mean, I get what they mean, but still, it's just a, it's just, it's just, it's, it's just a thingy. Oh no, Satan! Wow. Okay. Anyways, I also bought some. Uh, oh yeah, I bought a little watercolor palette. I also bought some makeup. This one is called Gothica. The dark side palette. I think that's cool. Looking forward to using, to using the black one. Black eyeshadow, love black eyeshadow. Also bought some more black eyeshadow. This is my favorite thing ever. Um, Essence, uh, Essence Soft Touch. This is color pitch black. I used to have this exact one that I bought myself with my money, but then it disappeared randomly when my mother was cleaning up my room. Turns out she had taken away my eyeshadow. I asked for it back, she gave it back in a few months' time. Um, however, my Essence Soft Touch Pitch Black eyeshadow was not as easy. 
So I bought some more. Um, my mother had no clue where it went. Maybe she threw it out on accident, but I don't know. I'm so happy that I retrieved it. I also bought this cute little skull, um, red nail polish. It was one in black, but that was online and I couldn't find it in store. Like, look how, look how pretty that is. Also, I'm thinking about, um, getting my nails done next week. My mother, she's getting paid. And she said that she can, she could buy me something fancy. And so I was thinking, get my nails done. Cause like, look at my horrible little hands. Like they look, they look weird. Like, ugh. Am I right? I had you guys like this watch I bought. The brand is, it's called San Quiang. It was five bucks from the variety store. Look, I've had it for like two weeks. This thing, it's already kind of like, like that. And also the buttons on it, like, like these buttons, these buttons work, right? These buttons, however, they're fake buttons. Anyways, yeah, I bought two more things, more makeup. I also bought this little uh, Gothica eyeshadow thing. I mean, eyeliner. There's one, it has a star on it. <laughs> and the other one, it's a line. It's a line. It's, it's a line. Liquid eyeshadow is... I'm gonna get used to it someday. That's, that's what I'm gonna say. Usually, like, I've been using this one same eyeliner. Um, so you see, funny story, this, this eyeliner, it's from the doll store, however it was $2.50. Anyways, so yeah, I was, I, my friend bought me that. The story was, it was November 31st last year, I was going to school, I had brought my eyeliner to school, but then, as I was going to put on my eyeliner, one problem, I did not have my eyeliner, it got lost. So I asked my, my dearest friend at the time, Karina, Hey, I lost my eyeliner. I'm so sad. Coincidentally, it was my birthday tomorrow, and she had somehow brought my birthday present today. She pulled out my birthday present for tomorrow. It was in a, it was this exact eyeliner, and she gave it to me, and she was like, here, go tell, and I've been using it ever since. It's actually lasted for a really long while, especially considering that's from the doll store, like, damn. Oh, yeah, anyways, uh, so yeah, pretty cool about this. And it has little moths on it. I have some cute little moth earrings. That's cute. Um, I mean, it's not, uh, it's not like uh, I can exactly showcase moths in my makeup. Like, you know, can you see the cute little moths on it? So, um, I mean, I'm not sure how that's gonna work. Actually, no, I don't care. Wait, uh huh? What am I going on about? I don't know. I'm sorry. Anyways, yeah, last thing I bought. It's some sort of lip stain and it's bloody. Texture is glue. Tastes like glue. Looks the same. Um, oh yeah, guys, do you know how to get makeup off of your beauty blender? I tried the thing with dish soap and microwaving it, but I think that just spread the foundation around even more. Because this, I need this beauty blender to be clean so I can see the color of it. Because this is actually from Essence's, uh, um, the, the, the color changing pink and black one. It's pink when, it, I mean, it's black when it's cold, but then if you, like, if you, like, warm it up, it's, like, pink. But then, once it gets, like, once it gets cold, then it starts to turn black. Are those teeth marks? No, it can't be. I don't know. I love Essence. They make such good makeup products, and they're a vegan brand too. That's all for today, gamers. Make sure to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you get all your stuff today. Bye bye!